Hello, and welcome to Cindy's Corner. Have you ever been on an Easter egg hunt? You're going to get to tell me about your Easter egg hunt. So think about this Easter egg hunt as we go and see if you've ever had one quite like this. If you've got the book, The Best Easter Egg Hunt Ever, go get it so you can follow along. Look at that egg. What do you think's in there? Got a rabbit here, got a little chicken, got a duck. My AR testers, this is a level two, three. Two, three. The title, <coughs> excuse me, the title page, the best Easter egg hunt ever. The author is Don Casey. The illustrator is Katie Hudson. On a warm spring day, in the tall grass, a little gray rabbit was sniffing the air. It was Easter Sunday. It was egg hunt time. Mother Rabbit said, there are lots of eggs to find. There are stripy ones. There are spotted ones. There are blue, sky blue eggs. Pale pink eggs. And eggs as bright as buttercups. I want a special egg, said Rabbit. And off she hopped to see what she could find. Down in the barnyard, Chick was hopping around a haystack. Please help me, Rabbit, he chirped, he cheeped. I can't reach that egg. Rabbit hopped onto the haystack in one leap, nestled in the hay, was a sky blue Easter egg. I don't have much time, said Chick, but I can give you some feathers to say thank you. Rabbit tucked the feathers into her basket and off she hopped. <clears throat> Over in the meadow, Butterfly had found a tiny egg, as bright as the, a buttercup. The flowers waved in the breeze, and the air was full of breeze. Rabbit hopped with hot happiness. She followed a buzzing bee and nibbled a yellow-green leaf. She picked a bunch of spring flowers. Oh, Rabbit laughed. I almost forgot about finding an egg. And off she hopped. Up on the hillside, lambs bounced and bounced. Rabbit looked for an egg in the treetops and the, in the hedges. She found some scraps of sheep wool stuck in the brambles, but she didn't find a single egg. So she hopped off. In the sun, in the sunlit woodland, Rabbit heard a squeak. I can't dig up this egg, said Mouse. I'll help you, said Rabbit. I can dig. Scrape, scratch, dig, burrow. Wow, breathed, Ma breathed Mouse, looking at the giant egg. 
the bigger that it's bigger than our whole mouse hole. And mouse gave rabbit some tasty grass to say thank you. Rabbit's ears dropped. Mouse found a very special egg. She sighed. But I haven't found any eggs. Rabbit didn't feel like hopping anymore. She sat down by the duck pond. And there, by the water's edge, was an egg. But it wasn't big or bright, spotted or stripy, pink or blue or yellow. It was small and dull and white. It doesn't look very special, said Rabbit. Rabbit touched the egg with it, her paw. Oh, she whispered, it's warm. A cool breeze blew. Rabbit shivered. Don't worry, little egg, she said. I'll keep you warm. And Rabbit emptied out her basket. She took the stalks of grass and the sweet flowers and the wave and, and wove them together. She shaped a little cup. She lined it with warm wool and soft feathers. She made a nest. And when the egg was safe and warm, Rabbit curled up close by, but she but was she was tired after her long day. Soon she was fast asleep. There's the egg in its nest. Beep beep. What was that noise? Beep beep. It was coming from inside the egg. The egg wobbled and rocked in the nest. And all the time, it went beep, 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 until crick. Out came a beak. And crack. Out came a duckling. Quack, quack, Mother Duck swarmed to, swam to shore. Oh, thank you, she said. My egg, I've been looking for it all day. Rabbit smiled. I'm glad I found this egg, she said. It's the most wonderful Easter egg of all. Okay. It's not going to know it's mama, is it? The end. So his egg or her egg wasn't blue, yellow, spotty. What was it? It wasn't pink. Wasn't striped. It was a real egg, made it a nest. What would you have done if you found that egg? Would you have tried to keep it warm? Or would you have broken it? Would you have had it for breakfast? What would you have done with that special egg? And have you ever found a special egg? And maybe you went on an Easter egg hunt and then you didn't find what you were looking for and you found something else. Tell me what you found on your Easter egg hunt. 
I hope you enjoyed our story. And I'm going to share with you a craft. You could just do a little duckling like this, make it yellow, just kind of cut it out, and then make you a white egg to go with our story. It's real easy. You just take a piece of paper and you can cut, say this is our paper. You can take a piece of white paper and you can cut it like this. Make it like that. And then you can make you a yellow duck. That's its beak. And glue it in there. Make it yellow. And then you have your duck in your egg. I hope you enjoyed that. And I can't wait to see if you make a duck in an egg. And share with me on Cindy's Corner what you have found at your special egg hunts. Thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe and share with your friends. And most important, give somebody a hug and tell them you love them.